we have designed this demo video as a tutorial uh, of our PeopleX software. So we go step by step by setting up a plain 2.3 Elastix 64-bit installation. We have already installed our PBX. It is uh, nothing inside till now. It is complete empty. It is installed on IP 10.0.0.51 and uh, we, our Windows PC is on IP 10.0.0.10. At first, we switch on the security settings for an unembedded free PBX. For this, we go to the security button, change to the advanced settings, enable here the, the, uh, the non-embedded access to the free PBX, set here our password for it and uh, press then the save button so now we have access to the unembedded free pbx i go now to the unembedded free pbx i use my username and password and log in the next step is that we need for our installation for testing all the things in trunk and at least two extensions. For all people who don't have a trunk available, I will now create and demonst or demonstrate how to create a dummy trunk which works like a normal trunk but and it generates both seconds but it is only calling an IVR. For this at first we go to the system recording and uh, at the at the recording, and go to the built-in recordings, and choose a file of the of the of the uh, built-in recordings. Okay, let's show uh, choose for extended status report. It's equal which we are using. It's just only for our system recording. We go say go name it dummy press save now we create an IVR at IVR rename, rename it also dummy and choose for the announcement the dummy recording and also for the timeout message and invalid message and say the repeat loops are 9 and press save. So now we have created an IVR which is only saying some stupid things. And next thing we have to do is create an extension. We add an extension and generic zip extension. We give it uh, the uh, extension number 111. Create also a secret for us, 123 ABC and press submit. For this extension we have to add follow me settings. We go on a destination no if no answer, choose the IVR, choose the dummy and submit the changes. Now the next step to create the dummy trunk is to add a custom trunk. We name it dummy trunk. So set here then the dial string which is local at local 111 at from internal. So if someone is trying to call out from this trunk, it is calling the extension 111 at from internal, which is not installed, so it is going then through uh, this extension to the IVR and just uh, saying the things of the IVR. IVR. So we submit, submit now the changes, apply the configuration changes, Next thing is we need to create an outbound route or two outbound route at least for our system. We need to have, uh, we delete at first the 9 to outside route, then we create a new route, call it outbound. So this route should be able to call to every numbers. So we set here only uh, the, the, the dot and connect our dummy trunk to it. Additional, we add in a root emergency. 
This route only should be able to call the 911 as emergency number and also set here the dummy trunk as trunk. We press the apply configuration changes. Next thing we need is two extensions at least for testing the system. We go to extensions and create an extension 100. which is our reception phone. Set here as well the secret 123 ABC and press the submit. Additional, we uh, create now an extension 101 which is our room phone. Set here as well the same number and press submit we go back up again to this room. We set the voicemail enabled. We apply the configuration changes.